All of you are wanting to know, is there an update on Kate Yup? In my last video, I went over all the hidden messages within her video, including spelling out help in her recent video. Well, I have been digging deep into her channel. I have heard enough of this and this to haunt me. I will be giving you all my thoughts and final updates to the real truth of Kate Yup. In Kate Yup's video, I am alive. There is a cup in the shot from a well-known escape room company in France called Challenge the Room. This brings up the point, does Kate work at an escape room or did she visit one? If she did, they have hundreds of pictures of groups that have gone through the escape room. Looking through them, there are some employees and even customers that have the look of Kate Yup. Kate could have also taken the idea of the cryptic mystery of an escape room and brought it into her mukbang videos to differentiate herself from others. In her videos, Kate wears a wristband. This was previously thought to cover a tattoo that she does not want to reveal. After further investigation, it looks as it is a way to wipe her mouth off without using her hands. Many other mukbang YouTube channels that Kate follows does this as well. In Kate's previous video, she has always worn a mask. I do not think she is wearing a mask to be looked at as unknown. Before her videos blew up, she was actually thinking about showing her face to the community. In the comments of one of her older videos, someone asks, why do you have a black mask? Her reply was, my nose is malformed. I already have had enough bad comments. I do not want to add another layer. The bad comments being people talking about her style of eating, which she considers savage eating, a way in which someone slurps, chews loud, and eats quickly. It seems like some like a little bit of a slower mukbanger. Kate's busted lip and bruised arms are explained by Kate as a cold sore and sun damaged. I looked through some of her older videos and in fact on the same spot on her lip you can see what looks to be cracked open. This happens multiple times over her videos which in fact would be a cold sore. Now to the bruises. Kate says they are caused by the sun. After looking at her previous videos compared to the video she has the bruise, you can see she has a bit of a tan. Considering Kate is of Korean ethnicity, she could be possibly dealing with hyperpigmentation, in which dark spots can develop with the sun looking like bruises and fade over time to go away. There is a theory that Kate is a UFC fighter. Her English is pretty broken on her captions which I'm guessing is due to English not being her first language. The theory is that she is a fighter of some sort, a Polish UFC fighter, and her name is Joanna Jedryski. If you look at her pictures, the smile is identical, and looking at the moles and beauty marks on her neck, it looks to match up somewhat. Joanna's sister is named Katie. Someone even wrote on Joanna's Instagram saying, Hi Kate, yup, in which Joanna said, Hi. I can say this is absolutely false. Joanna does not have the same tattoo as Kate. And the hi Katie up on Joanna's Instagram was probably seen by Joanna as hi from Katie up. Kate released a new video a few days ago called I dip seafood in my soda. Eight kinds of seafood. Let's break this video down. At 610, you can hear someone say swallow. Starting at 22 minutes and 23 seconds, text on the screen says, As you can notice, I am happy nobody is torturing me. At 23 minutes and 16 seconds, the text says, Oh no, I'm lying. In fact, there is people torturing me every day, without even knowing it. It is my final thought that Kate Yup is completely fine. From my research, she is in fact from Europe, Belgium to be exact, probably lives in Brussels. She speaks French and has broken English. She sources all of her seafood from a small local shop. She's probably of Korean ethnicity and admires other competitive Korean YouTubers. She has brown hair dyed blonde and has a tattoo on her wrist 
that she is not trying to cover up. I have tried to contact Kate multiple times to explain her side. She has not replied. Kate does not have any social media accounts besides YouTube. There is a Facebook account, but it is fake and ran by someone else acting as Kate. I also believe Kate likes the mysterious side of life and is adding puzzling texts and audio to her videos, considering she likes to go to places like escape rooms. Her subscriber count has tripled, so what she is doing now is obviously working. That being said, I want you all to go to her channel, give her some positive comments, because let's be honest, the amount of food she can put down is amazing, and maybe someday we will see the real identity of Kate Yup.